Yo, what's the deal? Super Sai here and we live with another Diner Dash. <laughs> so today, very exciting. See, I have my African attire on. Uh, even though I'm a West African descent, uh, the, today I'm gonna try a place called Boba Fair, which is a East African cuisine. Today we have a chicken and a lamb dish. Uh, let's get into it. The first dish that I have is called Kuku. And which is basically a fried chicken dish, pan fried chicken dish served with plantain um, and the rice and beans. So we, I, I actually got the coconut rice. Um, they had an option of either the coconut rice or like a spicy kind of rice. So yeah, let's get into it. Oh yeah, very tender. I'm feeling it. Yo. Yeah, that's really good. That's good flavor. You can tell. You can tell that gravy. This this gravy that they have here. It's a lot. It's a lot in it. It's a lot going going on right now. A lot of flavor that marinated. Mmm. Okay. That chicken is very tender. Let me try some of the beans. Mmm. Good. Kind of like baked bean kind of bob. It's cool though. It's cool, I rock with it. Now plantain, you know how I feel about plantain. And then solid. Ding! Mm -hmm. The cuckoo, the chicken, they got it down. The flavor on this, I can't even describe it. It's like some, some real home style, like tastes like something from home, but if your parents was from Africa, Okay, so next dish we have is mbuzi, which is a goat dish. Um, it does come with the rice and beans, but I got the goat out of the car just to try it. I also have this little corn mix here going on. I don't know why I want to try the corn first. Mm. Okay, it has that, uh, that coleslaw kind of vegetable salad kind of taste going on. Let's get into the... Ooh. Ooh. I don't know if the camera seen that, but I, the way I pulled that lamb right off, it peels. <laughs> it, it's like melting right off. It's crazy. I don't eat goat a lot, but I can imagine this is some of the best. Tastes like it's slow cooked. They took a lot, take put a lot of care into the the dressings and the gravies and the the flavors. Very authentic. Very 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 authentic. Or this is my first kind of East African art. Uh, authentic food tasting, but uh, I'm pleased. It tastes very authentic. Uh, I'm gonna have to give it a dime, and that's it. We gonna wrap it up there. Great food, authentic home style, make you feel good. Now I'm gonna cut it, cause I'm about to.